笑。Oh, five more, not thirty more. Kidding, lah. We won't put it in. Can you see, oh, put it in. Hello. Hello. Okay, don't use colander. <laughs> Must add the MSG for the flavor, cause MSG is the king of flavor. <laughs> wow, eh, 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 wow, this is this is my whoa. This is my first time touching the cooking appliances. What I need, ah? Firstly, I need garlic. Garlic is essential. Whole thing will be fine. Garlic. Oh, soy sauce. Soy sauce. Salt. This is sugar. <laughs> salt. Pepper. So these are the ingredients you need: garlic, egg, onion, overnight cooked rice, salt, black pepper, oyster sauce, light soy sauce, and oil. I'm very stressed. I'm very stressed. Okay, how my grandma teach me is that you need to put the knife like that and crush. But then I don't have strength, and I also scared I cut my hand, so I don't crush. I think y'all can take a thirty minutes break. Ah, then y'all come back. Then I'll be done with the garlic. So, uh, 30 to 45 minutes later, I'm done chopping my onions and garlic. Now, I'll move on to my egg. I have two eggs. One of it is supposed to be stirred into the rice together and mix it all together. The other one is a sunny side up. <sighs> so, right, if you all really take a look at the egg that you crack, there might be spots of black, spots of red and spots of white. Okay, so, you see this red, red thing, right? Take out. Don't eat it. Wow, hey, look at these stirring skills. After you take out all the junks, you don't have enough egg. <laughs> I'm gonna break one more in. Oh my god, wouldn't it be great if Uncle Roger react to this whole video? Hello, Uncle Roger. We Eat Book would like you to react to these videos. We are from Singapore, your neighbor. And I would just like to say that my boyfriend looks just like you. Whenever I watch your videos, I laugh a lot and I get reminded of my boyfriend. <laughs> oh, I can imagine what he would say if he watched it. Hi, this miss you say I look like a boyfriend yet cannot cook egg fried rice to my twin out there. I think you should break up with her. Okay, okay, okay. The pan is hot, so I'm gonna add some oil in. Then you wait for the oil to hot up. Hot up. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. It feels hot, so I'm gonna add the garlic and onion in now. Can you smell it? While waiting for this to cook, I'm gonna add some light soy sauce and oyster sauce into my egg. Oh, is this sesame oil? Sesame oil! Wow, hang. Okay, so guys, do not add oyster sauce in this. Oyster sauce is for vegetables. Add sesame oil. Wait, no time, no time. I add my rice first. Tiao wei liao. So I always stir it and mix it to make sure that every part of my fried rice is covered in oil and garlic and onions. Almost done guys, almost done. Stay with me, bear with me. Okay, and then before you pour the egg, you make a hole in the centre of the rice. After that, you fold your rice in. So beautiful! Stir, 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 stir. Can you smell the sesame oil? I think I put a bit too much. Uh, I think the egg too much. Not enough rice. A bit don't look like the egg fried rice I cook at home. <laughs> Some pepper. Why my colour like that? Uh? Based on gut feeling, I feel like I need to add more light soy sauce. Oh shit, too much, too much. Now, I've also decided to not do the sunny side up egg. Because I did not portion out my rice and egg properly. Now it looks like egg at rice, not rice at egg off. 
Ching says smells good. But you know what? When I cook the egg glue oil for Rhino, everybody also says smells good. But when they eat, when I eat, no taste. Okay, so these are the ingredients I'll be using. Rice, eggs, garlic, onion, black pepper, salt, ham, soy sauce, oil and spring onion. Okay, so garlic. I'm gonna use all. Okay, fast right. Just any other chop, honestly. Okay, means thin enough really. Apparently that's what you need to do. I don't know how true is that, but... Ooh, it smells good. But I have no strength. Oh my god, I cannot! <sighs> Need a guy. Can I open this? <laughs> I can't open. Oh. That's easy. How do you take it? Oh! Hey, thanks. <laughs> okay, I'll heat up the pan first. Sorry, I just want to use this piece for my plating. So, nice, nice. And then I'm gonna dice it. Add a little bit of oil. And then we'll fry. Ooh, ooh. My ham is turning into a very nice colour. I'm gonna add my egg to my rice. I'm gonna season it a little bit. And then pour into my rice. You know why I like to do this? Cause right, it will really look like Ting Tai Fung's fried rice. So I think our luncheon meat is about done. Add in the onion and the garlic. Once the garlic turn a bit golden brown, you want to add the rice with it. Cause like, the longer you fry it, it will become chow da. Press it down and then mix everything in. Wow, can you smell it? It's still a bit moist, a bit wet, right? So when it's like, Almost dry but not dry yet. You can add soy sauce. A little bit. According to my mother, how you know whether your fried rice is ready is when your rice starts to jump. This is a very Chinese flavour, which is white pepper. I'll put a little bit. Oh, do you see it? It's gonna jump. You will put... No, 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 no. I really feel like this is a challenge to see how bad I am at cooking eh. And the more I say I cannot cook, the more you put me in this show. Psych! You're about to see this kitchen for the last time before I burn it. <laughs> 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 okay, so these are the ingredients I need. Of course, we need rice, garlic, we've got onion, eggs, uh, my favourite mixed vegetables, some chicken sausages, chicken franks, white pepper, we've got some salt, fish oil, light soy sauce, oyster sauce, and of course oil to cook. How many cloves of garlic do I need? Okay, the thing that people do right, is they take a knife and they pluck it. Is this what I do with this? <gasps> eh! It works! It came out of the shell! You know, I think one is enough. Two cloves? A bit more garlicky, I think? Next is the onion. Okay, cut. How do people get like the diced onion kind of situation? This is literally the first time I'm cutting onions, okay, in my entire life. Oh lord, I think can I can I can I don't care already. How many sausages do I think I need? One, two, maybe. You know what? That looks semi-alright. Time to heat the pan. 
I think a little bit in it. My butchered um, garlic cloves and like just <laughs> saute it. The oil is a bit hot. <laughs> yes? Oh, you know what? Actually, this one later I take out. <laughs> I throw away. I just want the oil to be infused with the garlic. Bye bye. Sorry. Okay, 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 okay. Oh no. This does not sound good at all. Okay, I think I will throw in all the ingredients at the same time. Yeah, you know what? Some chopped <laughs> onions. <laughs> Some sausages while I'm at it. Hey, why the rice like not becoming any colour? You know what? That's why. I know what's missing. Not the <laughs> Oh yeah, more. The more the merrier. I think this one. Colour. We love some colour in our lives. Okay, next I need to put the soy sauce. I don't know how much to put. You know what? Eyeball it. <laughs> I think that's too much, but you know what? We'll go with it. You know what? To solve it, a little bit of oyster sauce here. Can't put my rice damn salty. And you know what? Some fish sauce for good measure. God bless. Hey, come on. You tell me that doesn't smell good. At some point, a little bit of pepper. Hey, smell like pepper lunch. Oh, f me. <laughs> I forgot to prepare the egg. <laughs> I cannot like crack an egg lah. Oh la. no, me <laughs> You see, he come in, he scared me. How does one incorporate air into it? Huh? That's what he, uh, Maverick said when um, he was making his scrambled eggs, right? Oh, I want like a fluffier egg, so I'm mixing a lot of air into the egg mixture. Alright, God bless. Bismillah. Oh oh, oh oh, oh oh. Eh, okay, okay, okay. Oh my god, it's becoming like porridge. I think you need a bit of salt. This is like the first time I'm making fried rice. I feel like I'm like quite proud of myself. Like it doesn't look as nice, but considering right, it's edible and it's not burnt. And that's the most important thing. So what I'm using is short grain rice, spring onions, pepper, salt, eggs, garlic, leftover onions from I don't know where, soy sauce, chinchalok and oil. Let's go. So I'll be heating up the pan first. Oh, I cut my ingredients. Okay, the green parts are going on top. Or the white parts are going into my oil. So next are the onions. Then my garlic. Okay, now I'm waiting for it to heat up. Uh, let me crack my eggs first. Okay, now the pan is hot enough, so I'm going to add my oil in. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is to put my onions and the white parts of my spring onions in first. So I'm going to cook this until it becomes fragrant. Okay, once you get the aroma coming out from the onions, add in your garlic. Okay, while my aromatics are toasting, I'm going to uh, scramble my eggs. So just before the garlic burns, right, is when you want to add your rice in. So when you add your rice, you want to make sure it gets declumped. That's so what you want to do is cook it at a high heat to get the texture that you really want in fried rice. Every year I'm fighting in the rice. <laughs> I am. Why are you so clumpy? Yeah, I don't know what to say, man. Just. Fry some rice. Okay, now you just gotta be patient, okay? Wait for the rice to crisp up a bit. Crisp up, crisp up. And once you get that bit of char that you want, right? You drop the heat, and then you add in the seasoning. So I'm going for a very simple seasoning, just soy sauce and white pepper. And if it's not salty enough, I'll add in a bit of salt. So just a bit. What? No one saw that. We have white pepper. Let me try. Yeah, a bit more soy sauce. So I found this very interesting ingredient in the fridge. It's called chinchalok. If you don't know what it is, it's basically fermented shrimp. And they blend it with a bunch of chilies and spices. So I'm going to use a bit of it to flavour my rice. Oh, can you smell it? Nice, right? The last thing you do is to incorporate the eggs in. 
So what I'm going to do is to turn up the heat. I'm going to add a bit of oil in. I'm going to add my eggs. In fried rice, right, you want the eggs to be almost brown. So I'm just waiting for my eggs to cook. Once the eggs are almost cooked, right? See, one side is brown and one side is not cooked yet. You want to mix the eggs in with the rice. Okay, tastes good. Wow, look at this plate of gold. It's good. <laughs> I think it's because of the sesame oil and the soy sauce. Oh, I don't nice, eh? What? I feel I outdid myself, eh? <laughs> okay, if I have to rate this out of 10, I'll rate it a 7. Because honestly, it's quite plain. It's only, it's just an egg. Rice and egg, that's all. I'm quite surprised with myself because I started off very extremely not confident. Even towards the end, I wasn't confident. Everything was a mess. I was a mess. But I don't know how this happened. But this happened. Good day. It's not bad. But I wish I put a little bit more salt. But never mind. Ah. There's luncheon meat already. So the luncheon meat is already salty. How will you rate your fried rice? Mm, 10 out of 10. Then. You get what I mean, right? Should be a bit saltier. Mm. <laughs> okay, what? Why do you look so disappointed? Because it's too moist. Okay, it's a bit like too like porridge, a little bit. That's what I said. So it's not bad. The rice is overcooked lah. Oh, is it too much sauce? Don't know what like become a bit like got Mush. too much water. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Maybe it's the wrong rice I use. Eh. But the taste is okay. I'm actually surprised at how it tastes lah. I think the texture is the one thing that is the failure here. I wish it was drier, and I wish it was a longer grain rice kind. You got put garlic? Try the garlic, show. Sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay, thanks, Brenda. Bye bye. Okay. <laughs> this is the first time putting ginger lot into my fried rice. I want to put sambal in, but then could have tried sambal. I think it's a very good alternative because it's a bit like sambal belacan, but it's a bit more funky. Actually, I put a lot of eggs into this one plate of fried rice because I love eggs, as you can see. It's just the way I like it. Right, and I think with fried rice, right, you cannot go easy on the oil. If not, you'll get a very wet rice or you'll get burnt rice. Yeah, so very simple. Just soy sauce base with eggs and ginger lot. Nice. So comment down below and tell us what you want to see our colleagues cook next. Thank you very much for watching this episode of How You Cook It. If you like this video, you can watch our other videos over there. You can like, share and subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Bye. Probably next episode because you always want to sabo me. Watching live.